And then, yeah, it was day 31, day 32, that we got a call from the West Vancouver SPCA saying, we have your cat here. And we have another cat, which I was looking at at the time, and I was thinking, no, my cat is here. So I said to her, well, can you describe the cat? And so she's, you know, he's this black and white cat, and he's a little skinny. And I asked her about his tail, because he has a crooked tail. And she said, yeah, he has a crooked tail. So we were like, wow, maybe that's him. And he has a tattoo in his ear, which is how they came to find us. So we headed out first thing in the morning and went and picked him up. You know, he, he was a skinnier version of himself. He was dirty. And he was definitely defeated and sad. Uh, but he recognized us right away. And he started purring. And we brought him home where he slept for three days and just ate and slept. <laughs> One thing we've noticed that he's been doing since he's home is he's catching and eating grasshoppers in the yard, which he never used to do before. So I think perhaps he was kind of fending for himself, living on his own. Um, he was found finally in the British properties. A kind lady noticed that he was hanging around her yard for three days. And I think eventually he just gave up and went to her. And I think by that time he was, he was pretty malnourished. So I think he finally just gave up and realized that he had to go and get some help or he wasn't going to make it. Well, we never wanted Socks to be an outdoor cat. Um, our other cat certainly doesn't go outside. But Socks is a different type of a cat. He is a big, large male cat, and he was just never content to be in the house. So I wouldn't even tell you that we would let him out. He would just escape a lot. If you open the door, he would trip you and scoot outside. So what's changed is now he doesn't do that. He doesn't really want to go outside. He seems a lot content to be in the house, which ideally is really what we wanted for him all along. So hopefully he, he will be content to stay in <laughs> now that he's learned his lesson.